There is a book called Outliers by Malcolm Gladwell. It is one of the books and one of the authors I love the most and I have always told this. I don't know if you have heard this. So I will try to find out Outliers by Malcolm Gladwell. He says that to achieve perfection at something, the, there is a rule that applies. 10,000 hours a week. So if you start practicing something very early, by the time you are 16 or 18, you have finished that 10,000 hours. You know teachers who have been teaching for 20, 30 years have done that. 10,000 hours of teaching they have achieved. So when they walk into the class, they are sure they are able to finish it to their satisfaction. But when you are a teacher for the next third year only, you go to teach and you are not prepared, you copy that teacher, then you land into a problem. Because you have not yet finished thousand hours also of teaching. And you are copying something who has already finished 10,000, 20,000 hours of teaching. You understand? Experience is very important. So it comes to them, there is a naturalization process that has happened with them which will take some more time to happen for you. So practice is very, very important. So nowadays, people start doing things very early. Teaching their children, deciding their vocation and then getting into it, forgetting everything else. You see uh, the Tata Archery Academy and all, what do they see? They, they choose children when they are in 8th standard, take them to the academy, make them practice every day, every day, every day, take them to different tournaments. They win or lose, that's not a criteria. They keep on supporting the students. And then finally, most of them who are surviving at the academy are able to get medals at the Olympics, at other events. Okay? Because when is the 10,000 hours? is finished, achievement will be there. Okay? So that is called naturalization. So these are all, with all the activities, all these are the steps that we have discussed about. Imitation, manipulation, precision, articulation, and these have to be targeted when we are taking the class. Okay? You have to decide for which portion of the chapter you are doing what. So now when you write your lesson plan, when you will, I told the bring a notebook, a book of your choice from where you can choose the lesson. When you will write a lesson plan, what you will need? You will first require to know the learning objective and learning outcome. These are the two things. Now what is learning objective and what is learning outcome? Okay? What is the objective? Objective is teacher-centric. Am I right? Yes. What is the objective of the lesson? It is teacher-centric. What is the learning outcome? It will be? Am I right? You agree? Outcome is something which the students will be able to say. Student defines, arranges. Isn't it? You give a, a number of pieces of squares. Okay? And ask them to classify them with the number of sides. There is a triangle which has two sides. Three sides, sorry. And there are three sides. Then there is a quadrilateral. There is a pentagon. So that the child has to arrange it. Three sides, four sides, five sides, six sides. Okay? So that will be achieved when the child will know about the different figures. That is learning outcome. What is the learning objective? What is the learning objective? The teacher tries to do something 
to let the child understand that this is the way to keep things. Okay? What are signs? What are figures with different signs? Okay? A line. Okay? And then join them together to make a triangle, to make a square, to make a rectangle, to make a quadrilateral. All similar figures will be there. Hmm? And then hexagon, heptagon, okay, octagon, like that. So you are all following? Or else the teacher, English teacher will say that there is a for example, if I will say this to a class 1 child, it will not be appropriate. Will it be appropriate? The child has never heard what is a triangle, what is a square, isn't it? So what we are talking about is specific, measurable, attainable, realistic and time bound. Okay? Learning objective has to be specific. You should be precise. What do you want to achieve? It should be realizable. It should be measurable. Can you measure small, big, large, achieved, not achieved, achievement 10%, 20%, 30%? Attainable. Class 1 will not attain that. That will be attained by class 3, class 4. So, it has to be attainable. It has to be realistic. Samaj me aana chahiye. Isi abhi thoda sa aapko nahi samaj me aana. Ya chal raha hai. This is smart goals. And then, it has to be time based. ऐसा तो नहीं हो सकता कि स्क्वायर समझाने में आपको साल लगा देंगे क्लास थ्री को तो फिर कैसे चलेंगे? It has to be 45 minutes period है इसमें ये नहीं कि ये पढ़ाना है ये आपको करना चाहिए। So then we say it is time bound. I will come to I will share with you something now that you will read. Okay, I will tell the page number. I will share or I will forward it on WhatsApp. Because we didn't print so many pages, if it will be on your WhatsApp, you will be able to read it. Okay? Okay, fine. But you will read only the page that I will say. Of course, the activity then I will ask. Otherwise, the activities will get resolved. You will read what has to be done. Okay, so this is that. Okay, I will share a little bit. So, we are learning objective is a smart one. जब आप लेसन प्लान डिसाइड करते हैं, तो आपको पता होना चाहिए कि योर लर्निंग ऑब्जेक्टिव इस मार्ट, टू द एक्टिविटीज फीचर्ड। अब आपने लर्निंग ऑब्जेक्टिव दिया, उसके बाद क्या है? एक्टिविटीज होगी, ठीक है? अंडर दैट लर्निंग ऑब्जेक्टिव, यू विल डू समथिंग, यू विल वर्क ऑन अचीविंग दैट, does the assessment plan connect to the learning objective? जो आपने plan किया है, वो connect करता है learning objective से. Reflection. Does the reflection revisit the three legs? Experiential learning objective. क्या three legs हैं? Cognitive, affective, psychomotor. वो तीनों को address करता है. Activities, links, activities and assessment objective. As activities and assessment, are they linked together or not? Okay.
से हटेगा नहीं यू शुड नॉट बी दैट एल्काइड्स बनाना है उसका स्ट्रक्चर तो वो सिंगल बॉन्ड कर रहा है ओके सो दिस इज व्हाट इज एक्चुअली नेचुरलाइजेशन रिपीटेड डूइंग प्रैक्टिस एंड इट विल गेट रिफाइंड सो द टीचर इज टेलिंग व्हाट इज द लर्निंग ऑब्जेक्टिव ओके एंड देन लर्निंग आउटकम इज स्टूडेंट सेंट्रिक learning outcomes are expectations from the students as to what they will be able to achieve or accomplish at the end of the teaching in a course theek hai wo kya kar pate however learning outcomes do not give an indication of the types of activities that will be undertaken during the duration of the course activity kuch bhi hua outcome ye hai wo it will not depend on the activity while objective will depend on the activity for that matter learning outcomes even do not indicate the methods that will be used by a teacher to teach the subject matter to the students method pe bhi depend nahi kar raha learning outcomes are actually desired outcomes in the form of what teachers expect from their students at the end of teaching in a course these days teachers write down learning outcomes in the form of works that are measurable so as to avoid any confusion or misinterpretation okay so what a faculty member covers during the duration of a course is defined as learning objectives objectives are always specific and measurable okay they are also attainable and realistic all objectives are desired ones which mean they reflect what student should be able to achieve by the end of the course what the students will study read gain and understand is the basis of learning object Will be based on objective of the teaching. What is the difference then between outcomes and objective? Learning outcomes and objectives must be clearly delineated and defined at the start of the course. If this is not done at the outset, both the creativity of the faculty and the responsibility of the faculty get affected, thus making development of curriculum a very difficult task. You are. not at all clear ki hai kya learning objective what are we going what are the activities we are going to do to attain that objective and to expect that outcome objectives are what the teacher sets out to teach fine outcomes are what is expected of students at the end of the course practically speaking outcome should be identical to objectives if the faculty has indeed taught everything in such a manner that students have grasped everything and are able to attain the level of proficiency that the teacher has desired is this clear now to everyone what is objective and what is outcome outcome i just want to explain in two words outcome is student centric objective is teacher centric Activity will be done by the teacher, and evaluation will be done by the teacher on the basis of the learning outcome achieved by the students at the end of the term or at the end of the chapter. So when you set out to write a lesson plan, what are you supposed to do? पहला चीज आप क्या करेंगे? Name of the chapter, sub topic, okay? duration date duration you will write what is the learning objective you will state the objective okay activities that will be taken by you what will be the activity which part of experiential learning you are targeting not just this we have to add to teach you two more things before you will be able to start writing a lesson plan what are those two things bloom's taxonomy आधा बता दिया है फिर से बताएंगे वर्ब्स दैट शुड बी यूज्ड एंड देयर आर वर्ब्स व्हिच आर नॉट मेजरेबल पहले जमाने में हम लोग सब वर्ब्स यूज करते थे जो भी मन में आया लिख देते थे बट नाउ वी आर सेइंग टू यूज द वर्ब्स एंड नॉट यूज सर्टेन वर्ब्स ओके बिकॉज़ दे आर नॉट मेजरेबल नॉट रिलेटेबल पहले क्या बोलते थे वीक इन मैथ्स बोल के चल दिया मैथ्स हम लोग तो ऐसे ही पढ़ते है ना बोल दिया वीक इन मैथ्स क्या वीक बाबा 
एडिशन नहीं आता है सब्ट्रैक्शन नहीं आता है अल्जबरा नहीं आता है मैंस्ट्रेशन नहीं आता है इंटीग्रेशन नहीं समझ में आ रहा है क्या कहां क्या गलती है वी हैव टू बी वेरी वेरी प्रिसाइज इन टेलिंग अ चाइल्ड और टेलिंग अ पेरेंट रिपोर्टिंग द प्रॉब्लम ऑफ द चाइल्ड टू द पेरेंट व्हिच इज द कांसेप्ट दैट द चाइल्ड इज नॉट एबल टू अटेन what is the which learning outcome has not been achieved by the child should be targeted as a school we wish that we are able to make lesson plans okay i will ask you to make a format you can go ahead and print the format that is conceptualized by this to achieve this okay so so what is this what, what next here i am forwarding this uh, handout to you okay I wanted this to be heard properly instead of everyone doing it. And then I will ask you to write a lesson plan after doing a few more slides. Okay? So come to the last one where we were. So we have to fix the learning outcome. Okay? This is flow chart. Learning outcome has to be fixed. आपने objective लिखा आपने ये, ठीक है? आपने learning outcome लिखना होगा. What is the outcome expected by you? What is your objective to teach the chapter? Course and motion का क्या objective होगा फिर हम लोग इस पे? Like objective will be the child will be able to recognize whether the course is a contact course, non-contact course. Okay. And then what will be the outcome? Outcome will be. Ah, this is outcome. Child will be able to do the outcome. What is your objective? To teach them different types of course. Yeah, to teach them different types of course. Different types of course. Different types of course. Different types of course. Where? Types, uh, to explain, uh, to demonstrate, what is a force? Ha, what is a force? Ha. What do you mean by force? Ha. Okay, the force word itself will be. So subject class, ab dikhenge. You will go through the topic, select one concept, concept for experiential learning plan. Okay. You will then define the learning outcome. Okay. Step one will be activity. Activity will consist of three main steps. What will be the three main steps of the activity? What is the prior knowledge of the child? You should know what is the learning outcome. Uh, activity will include three main things. Objective or outcome of the activity. Activity come to activity. Activation of prior knowledge, then discussion on the process. कैसे करेंगी मैम discussion on the process? She will say force is this. She will, for example, say to bring this bottle here, and she will say when I apply force, it has moved. And she might say that when I apply force on this glass. So certain activities, prior knowledge she will check, then discussion on the process, and then she will ask assessment. There are three parts of the activity. Activity involves activation of prior knowledge, discussion on the process, and then assessment. Step two is step one is activity. Okay. Step two is. Reflection. Under reflection, what will come? Okay. What will come? What went well? Okay. 
conceptualization and application of the concepts made by me during this is repeatedly being done, you know. Repeatedly you have to reflect, you have to conceptualize, then you have to apply in the next class that you do. Is that all right? So same thing is depicted here. First I wanted to read this out for you. Here we are mixing learning after. Okay? So okay, let us do this after you. So now I will come to you. So Bloom's taxonomy uses smart technique. Smart is specific, measurable, achievable. What is measurable? Assessment is facilitated if the learning outcome is measurable. Achievable can go through the complete learning cycle. Can be achieved. Realistic, it is not vague. Understand and realize our words which are vague according to you. We always use. Understands. If not understands, what understands? Realizes. Then we have time bomb. Class 1 ke liye, class 1 ke level ka hona chahiye. Okay? One year mein itna karna hai. One के लिए three का goal जो करते हैं वो अच्छा नहीं होता है। Like in some schools they do class eleven maths also in class nine. Is it achievable? It is not achievable. We are be fooling ourselves. The mind of the child is not built to take that much. We are forcing the child to beyond the mental capacity and that is the same they are all unique people are all unique they are neither superior nor inferior neither equal what are they then unique and incomparable you cannot compare people they are all unique and incomparable okay so, our goals have to be smart. Come to next. So, appropriate verbs have to be used and it has to be addressed to an associated activity with provision for assessment and reflection. Then, come to next. Come to next. <laughs>
getup Taxonomy 
cognitive domain. One, if you will write, you will understand your memory. Two, you will write, you will understand. Understanding. Three, apply. You don't have to write your name. But three, apply. Four, analyzing. C, three, cognitive domain. One, is what? Remembering. C, D, A. Analyzing or applying. Three is A, B, you can write for applying. Or A, M for analyzing. Next, next one. Something else will be understanding. Something come and read. Hello.
statement. You will show a flag. You will say this is green, this is saffron, this is white. Example. Okay? Explanation. Interpretation. That these three colors are where are they present on the flag. That understanding is being given to the child. Then reaction or solution to given problem. If the child is saying white and is looking at the grass, you will say the grass is green. Okay? So you will show white color, you will show milk maybe and say milk is white. So statement such as treatment, reaction or solution to given problem create examples of metaphors. You will ask the child, what are the white things you eat? You will say rice. Somebody will say milk. Isn't it? Somebody will say egg. Then you will say there is one more color in egg. What's that? And the child will say yellow. So this is interpreting. Okay? Examples and metaphors. Okay? Then we come to what are the verbs? Explain. Reiterate. That white is milk. Egg is English. That is white. Reward, critique. Bacha bode ga na ki some flower. You will say this red flower. <coughs> they will say white also we have ma'am. We have white roses also. You will say red roses. So you will say we have white roses also. We have yellow roses. The moment you will say egg, they will say white. Someone will come and say yellow also. Then someone will say rose also is yellow. So these are all. The uh, critique, reword, classify, summarize, illustrate, translate, review, reviews, other things which are white. Koi bolega chow mein to koi bolega no 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 that has sauce and its color. Isn't it? Chocolate. The other will say no no they are more often brown. No no they are white also. So lot of these reiteration, reviews, interpret, theorize, paraphrase, reference, example, all these things will these will be the verbs for understanding. You know if this should be printed in large size and put on your your what your uh, statues. Where you can sit and then we will be taking these rooms from the, uh, the new white house that we have. I don't want to call it old admin block. We have new white house. So at that, when we make teachers room, please make big posters. I need helping hands which will support and get these things done. Okay? So those four areas are there, you can just write there. Three, four walls are there, you can big words you can write, no? So understanding will have these things. Applying, applying is another cognitive domain. What comes under applying? Use or apply knowledge. Put theory into practice. Use knowledge in response of real circumstances. Jo knowledge tha, usko apply karne Kaha use ho Force and motion padna. So where are the different forces used? How are we going to apply it in day to day life? When you say, uh, Absorption, you teach in class 6. Hmm? You say drying. What is drying? What is absorption? How is drying different from absorption? Then the child will apply the knowledge and understanding of what is dry, what is absorbed, these two words, understand it, reflect, and then apply it and say, ma'am, this is drying, this is air drying. And he will take a, a paper and he will soak water and say this is absorption. Because he is trying to apply the 
knowledge and understanding he is trying to achieve it through the previous two steps agar remembering understanding nahi hoga to applying nahi hoga understanding nahi hoga to it kabhi nahi hoga to apply knowledge you have to know and understand Why do 
we have to eat fruits only? Why don't we eat grass? They can ask. So you have to give them reasons. Okay? Children ask various questions and we shut them. The teacher should never shut the question. Teacher should always try to reply, answer the questions. However, way the question may be. I remember my child used to ask me, ask me so often such questions. I still don't have an answer. It is okay, it's windy. I used to say, why is it raining with drop drop? Why is the rainfall falling slanting? Why is the rainfall, sometimes it rains heavily, sometimes it only drizzles. Why is it like this? What happens? Like you keep on trying to answer. At a point of time, if you don't have an answer. And then you try to tell the child to look at something else. But these questions every child asks. Because there is a scientist in every man. We try to shut it down. Because we are not free. We are busy with our phones. More children are coming with learning difficulties these days. All this delayed learning or a little slow learning is because you have spoken less to the child. You have given child Many children, you know, have delayed response these days. I have a child in my own close family, my cousin sister's grandson. That child only watches the phone I have seen. I thought he has some listening uh, problem or something. He listens when he wants to. Okay? So, the point is, the parents are choosing the device to be busy with their own work. Mummy is up, Papa is up, Bacha is up. So, the Bacha is going to be a good thing. The Bacha is You will see in school also, their speech is delayed. Speech therapists are thriving well. Because हम बच्चे से बात नहीं कर रहे हम बच्चे को स्पीच थेरेपिस्ट के पास बात करने को ले जा रहे हैं एंड यू नो अ मदर शुड स्टार्ट स्पीकिंग टू द चाइल्ड बिफोर द बर्थ ऑफ द चाइल्ड ओके अम द मोर द मदर स्पीक्स और द फादर स्पीक्स टू द चाइल्ड द बेटर द कम्युनिकेशन स्किल्स ऑफ द चाइल्ड ओके so, Bengali is not talking about Bengali. Because Mommy and Papa have never talked about Bengali. Mommy and Papa have talked about the child. When you do it, when you do it, you have to go to the school for two years. Go to the job. Come and go to the job. There is no time for you. You are sleeping, you are working, you are making food. The child has to show the TV on. The small, small things which are Making a difference. We are taking the child to the therapist to talk. We are also going to the therapist to talk. Because we have no one to talk to. Are you not seeing how many of you have a friend with whom you can sit down and not talk lies? I am talking to you with real reality in this life today. So. Do you talk your heart out to a friend? Do you have a friend whom you are able to tell everything? 99% people are not as lucky as you. If you are able to, if you don't have to pause and talk, if you don't have to lie and talk, reality is completely different from what we show. There are so many things which make a difference in who we are, what we do, how we do it, where from we come. Since you get up, what all you have faced before you landed here. Isn't it? So this makes us varied experiences. Lot of experiences we have. Lot of different people we are. But when we land to the class, we are the teacher of the child. We have to have that motherly love towards the child. That intention to teach it right. So, evaluating. 
You very evaluating, what do you do? You refuse. No, we didn't do this. Review strategic options or plans in terms of efficacy. Kya kiya activities mein efficiency hai ki return on investment. What is ROI? ROI is a very big thing. Return on investment kya hota hai? अभी आपने दो दिन का वर्कशॉप किया मैंने खड़े होके पूरा समझाया मुझे किसी ने कोई पेमेंट एक्स्ट्रा नहीं करना एंड आई वॉन्ट फॉर सीबीएसई वर्कशॉप आई वुड है ठीक है प्लस कन्वीनियंस ओके सो बी पी आर पी क्वालिफाइड फॉर पी आर पी यूल गेट पी आर पी एंड यू कैन गो सो I am not getting that, but it is my school. When you will learn and you will apply in the classroom, your lesson plans I will will come to me with all these appli applications. It will be I will be elated. Yes, we have achieved this. Then जा के मुझे क्या करना उस दो हजार का? क्या होगा दो हजार का? हम्म, कुछ नहीं मिलने वाला. वो अकाउंट में जाएगा जैसे और खर्चा हो जाता है हजारों वो भी खर्चा हो जाएगा बट इधर जो बिना पैसे वाला अचीवमेंट मिलेगा इट विल बी एक्चुअली व्हाट वी विल अचीव इट विल बी एक्चुअली व्हाट आई लर्न एंड व्हाट आई एम डिसिपेटिंग इट विल कम बैक जेड इट विल कम बैक टू मेक यू हैप्पी एवरी डे सो Return on investment, ROI. My time invested on you, or your time invested on this training, you will take home some messages. Yesterday also you went back with some messages. It was possible that I would have remained busy with my work. People would have tied me up with something. The whole day I would have signed. I would have done everything. Okay. Which I might have to do at the end of the day after this, okay? Which will be little taxing, but then return on investment will be there. ROI. आप अपने बच्चे को कॉलेज में पढ़ाते हैं, फीस लगती है, ठीक है? फीस लगती है हजारों में, लाखों में, करोड़ों में, कई साल के बाद तो इंटरेस्ट होके ज़्यादा भी हो जाती है ना? आपने टेंथ तक पढ़ाया फिर ट्वेल्थ तक पढ़ाया फिर कॉलेज भेजा अगर बाहर भेजा तो और भी ज्यादा लग गया ठीक है उसके बाद व्हाट इज आर ओ आई रिटर्न ऑन इन्वेस्टमेंट वेन द चिल्ड्रेन चूज कॉलेज दे सी आर ओ आई इस कॉलेज का आर ओ आई इंडेक्स क्या है कि इस कॉलेज के पढ़ने वाले एल्यूमनाई कहाँ कहाँ प्लेस हुए हैं उनकी सैलरी एवरेज सैलरी कितनी है Children are very smart these days. Based on that, they will choose college. They will say ROI is not there, so it is not going to help. So return on investment is what time or money or efforts you have invested. What is the outcome? Okay. So return on investment or cost effectiveness, practicability. Assess sustainability. What is sustainability? ये भी बिष्टुपुर बहुत अच्छा कर रहा है, ठीक है? कुछ लोगों ने कहा, कुछ लोग आए बोलने को आपके स्कूल में ये 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 गड़बड़ है। आपका कैमरा नहीं काम कर रहा, आपका टीचर नहीं पढ़ा रहा, आपके टीचर ने मार दिया, आपके टीचर ने ये कर दिया, बताना बताना पड़ा। ठीक है करेक्शन कहा गया जैसे बोला प्रिंसिपल को प्रिंसिपल के दिमाग में स्कूल यहां से कहा आ गया टू कीप इट हियर क्या करना पड़ेगा बुलाएगा को कब करेक्शन किया दिखा है ना खिंचाई होगी टीचर्स की क्लास ऑब्जर्वेशन होगा ठीक से पढ़ाई क्यों नहीं होती भाई है ना वो बुलाई प्रिंसिपल को इम्पोलाइट हरूस प्रिंसिपल बनना पड़ेगा Why? Because sustenance is at stake. 
Once you are here, to remain here is a bigger challenge than coming from here to here. It is a bigger challenge to remain. Okay, here is what is for you. Okay, that's fine. You have come from here to here. But sustenance means to remain here. To remain here, you have to keep on challenging all those who are here, 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 here. You have to do better than all those who are a few steps below. To do that, lot of efforts. Okay? That is sustenance. Perform a SWOT analysis. Evaluation may be Sara. SWOT analysis kya hota? SWOT stands for? Strength. Opportunities for improvement and threat. So what are the strengths for the school to remain here? It has very well paid teachers. It has good infrastructure. We have the best paid masters. So teacher retention is very good. Hardly any teacher leaves the school. Okay? So staff is all the times there. Lot of other schools have this problem. So that problem that they have, we have challenged. We have faced it. We have sustained it. Then that is strength. Then what is the weakness? Weakness? Bahar bada ho gaya school. Principal bar bar dekhne nahi ja pata. Teacher apne man ke ho gaya. Vaha ke teachers bahut liberated hai. Coordinator principal kisi ka nahi sunte hai. Ye baat karte lo. I'm talking truth. Okay? Ma'am class mein jahe ki tab to pata chale ga. Jisko jo man ho kar raha hai. Ye ye teacher late se ja raha hai. These are weaknesses. Okay? Strength, weakness. Then, opportunities for improvement. We are training you. We are discussing this. Because we are together. It is our stake. Each one of us. Our values are at stake. When we talk about one teacher, we talk about the whole community of the school. When one teacher is disrespected, everyone else is. When they talk about Yogi Vishnupur not doing well, all our efforts are at stake. Sustenance is in question. So opportunities for improvement we are discussing. We are reiterating our goals. We are talking about it. We are, we are deciding that we will not let it happen. Okay? These are opportunities for improvement. What is the threat? There are two, three people in the school or there are a few press workers whose child did not get admitted. I'm just giving an example. Don't take it as a job. Don't use that. So, some people did not get admission. So, that is a threat. They will talk negative about the school. What is it? Hmm? They, find the they will find the problems. And they will talk about it. So, these are threats. Every school has these threats. Okay? Then, the threat may be very good teachers of the school have retired. School is not able to get such teachers. New teachers joining are not as good as the previous teachers. So we did a SWOT analysis with BAVCMC and we discussed this. And we are in the process of discussion. We are saying in few years, the teachers who are with lot of experience, they will be retiring. The new lot that is coming, that is not of that level, then how will we run the schools? And teacher is written fine. So allow us keep them or make them continue for a few years till they are physically fit and fine. Otherwise, we have trained them, they have been experienced and they will go join some other school. So they will reap our efforts. Isn't it? So these are all threats analysis. Threat analysis also. Isn't it? So this is about 
Schwartz. Analysis in relation to alternatives. Analysis, I say. Produce a financial justific justification for a proposition or venture. Calculate the effects of a plan or strategy. Okay. Then perform a detailed risk analysis with recommendations and justifications. Risk analysis teaches retiring. So what to do? Take the teacher. Will the teacher be same when their salary will be less? They will not get lakhs of salaries. They will be on consolidated salary. Will the teacher do the same work as the teacher used to do earlier? Will the teacher come back or not? So these are all justifications, risk analysis. So what are the evaluation uh, works? While evaluating, you use the works review, justify, assess, present a case for, defend, Report on, investigate, direct, appraise, argue, project, manage. These are all the verbs we use. Then, uh, synthesis and all that we have removed, we are coming to creating the new one, 21st century one. Creating includes what? Develop new unique structures. System models, systems, models, approaches, ideas, creative thinking, operations. Okay? New, new ways to teach you are experimenting, no? Like we saw Oreo biscuit used for fractions, for eclipses. Isn't it? So you are, these are new innovative strategies. You take the students to a bank to teach them profit, loss, credit, debit. Then only they will understand it easier. You show them a passbook, ask them to bring an old passbook from home. And then they will see this is credit, this is debit, then it becomes less. When it is credited, it be, the amount becomes more in the passbook. So all these things you can teach. Develop plans or procedures, specific uh, plans or activities will have to be designed based on the creative ways to teach. Design solutions, integrate methods, resources, ideas, parts, create teams or new approaches, write protocols and contingencies. What are the works? Develop, plan, build, create, design, organize, revise, formulate, propose, establish, assemble, integrate, rearrange, modify. These are the works applicable. Okay, we will come to cognitive after this. Okay, shall we break? We will have a break. 20 minutes break. Half an hour. Half an hour. Thank you. So, 12.45. 25 minutes, not 30. Okay. Examples of experience or demonstration and evidence to be measured. Listen to teacher or trainer take interest in session or learning experience take notes turn up make time for learning experience participate passively what are the keywords or the words which describe the activity to be trained or measured at each level ask listen focus attend take part discuss acknowledge hear be open to, retain, follow, concentrate, read, do, be. Responding, react and participate actively. Examples of experience, participate actively in group discussion, active participation in activity, interest in outcomes, enthusiasm for action, question and probe ideas, Suggest interpretation. Please do not talk. Hello. Please. If you will talk, you will not follow. I will skip because I have given it to you and ask you to implement it on the lesson plan you write. Yes. The key words are react, respond, seek. Uh, react, respond, seek clarification, interpret, clarify, 
provide other references and examples, contribute, question, present, cite, become animated or excited, help team, write, perform. So you saw, we discussed, uh, uh, these are all coming from the heart. Right, uh, the first one receiving, you are open to listen. Open to, you are ready in the receptive mode. You all came back. Okay, I too saw it was 7.45.50 but I waited. Okay, so you came, you are in the receptive mode. Then we had, you listen to teacher or trainer, take interest in session or learning experience. Take notes, turn up, make time for learning experience, participate passively. Then what are the keywords? What are the keywords? Say something. Challenge. Why challenge? I have 
बोला कि ग्रेटिट्यूड टू गॉड मैंने फोटो दिखाया मैंने प्रेयर कराया ये एंड देन आई सेड सो दैट यू मे नॉट चैलेंज द वैल्यू ऑफ ग्रेटिट्यूड इसलिए देन आई गिव एन एग्जांपल ऑफ अ पर्सन हु डिड हैव राइट लेग्स टू लाइक वाज नॉट ब्लेस्ड विद हैंड्स एंड लेग्स लाइक अस इसलिए कुड नॉट सेट स्ट्रेट लाइक यू so i gave you so many examples to make you say yes to the gratitude <coughs> for which was the value i'm trying to impart to give you or let it you impart it my learning outcome was expected learning outcome was that you will all pay gratitude to god sabke man mein ye laana hai aaj shuru karne se pehle ki hum bahut acche hain achhi jagah mein hum bhagwan ne hame sab kuch diya Okay, so for that, what was the activity I was telling? I was giving you citing examples. I was making you do a prayer. Okay, giving example of a person who is not like you. Then citing some other things also. And then, so I challenged you not to argue with me. To gratitude. कोई बोल सकता था कि आपके कहने से क्या होता है? आपका सब कुछ ना मुझे तो बहुत चैलेंज है मेरे लिए. May I won't pay that much gratitude to God because why did God did this to me? Why did why only me? Lot of people say no. I have seen most of the cancer patients, for example, whenever whatever age a person is detected with cancer, always says why me? Why only me? Is it? So if there is any challenge, for example, if any family has any problems or anything. So people say, "No, why me? Why do I have to suffer?" Sometimes somebody's child is not born with all the hands, legs, eyes, ears, isn't it? Like every other child, a child is born blind. Okay, a child is born with the uh, limb deformities. So the mother has a lot of challenges. So she says, "Why me?" The mother will not leave the child. She will accept God's charge, but she definitely argues. Yeah, I was always good with everything. Why God chose me? So we always say, what do we say? Because God found you to be stronger than the rest. You will be able to face the challenge. So you, isn't it? So then, valuing, so argue, challenge, debate, refute, confront. Justify, persuade, criticize. These are the verbs. Organizing or conceptualizing values. Here, what are the behavior descriptors? Reconcile internal conflicts. Develop value system. अगर आप लोग टाइम से नहीं आएंगे तो it's no use. You have to tell you are Ryan Weeks being called so many times. I am not getting started. So when you are here, if you will go from here, you will be lost, and it is not going to help. Sign me. You will not be signed. Yes. So organizing or conceptualizing values, reconcile in problem context, develop value system, and what are the examples of experience? Or demonstration and evidence to be measured under this qualify and make for it. How much for God? How much for it? Okay. Come to this qualify and quantify personal views. Okay. Conceptualizing of values. Conceptualization जहाँ भी होगा ना तो वो पर person concerned हो जाता है. Are you seeing now? Because you will conceptualize, conceptualize something based on your level of understanding of the things, isn't it? So it is very, very personal. So uh, qualify, qualify and quantify for personal views. State Madhi personal Madhi. position and reasons. State beliefs. Will develop. Formulate, defend, modify, relate, prioritize, reconcile, contrast, arrange, compare. These are the verbs. 
ठीक है तो जब हम लोग लेसन प्लान लिखेंगे तो व्हाट वी विल राइट व्हाट इज द डोमेन अफेक्टिव विल राइट ए बी वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव वन होगा तो रिसीविंग होगा टू होगा तो रेस्पॉन्डिंग होगा वी विल राइट टू देन एक्टिविटी बेस्ड ऑन टू ओके देन वी विल React response C. These will be the learning outcome verbs. Verbs will be the learning outcome. Me verbs को डालेंगे. समझ में आ रहे हैं सबको? Yes ma'am. हाँ. Then we will come to internalizing values. मैंने क्या कहा? To strive to be an R N. To propagate R N values is the is the value system. What the vision we are our school we are having? Okay. So what do we say? We tell the children not to lie. Okay. We make them do havan. वहाँ पे भी हम बात क्या prayer करते हैं at the end of havan. पूजनीय प्रभु हमारे भाव उज्जवल कीजिए छोड़ ये वे चल कपट को मानसिक बल दीजिए क्या हुआ आर्यन बनाएंगे छल कपट को माफ कर दीजिए भगा दीजिए हमारे अंदर से ओके सो वी आर इंटरनलाइजिंग वैल्यूज एडॉप्ट बिलीफ सिस्टम एंड फिलोसफी सो वी आर प्लेइंग दिस सॉन्ग ओवर द माइक्रोफोन एवरी सैटरडे लेटिंग द चिल्ड्रन Hear this repeatedly. Okay? Self-reliant behave consistently. So, ye kya hai iska? What is this? These are the examples. Example of experience or demonstration and evidence to be measured. Okay? So, what we are doing? Making them self-reliant. क्या एक्टिविटी देंगे कि सेल्फ रिलायंस को इंडिविजुअल एक्टिविटी देना पड़ेगा लर्नर सॉन्ग है ना बिहेव कंसिस्टेंटली विद पर्सनल वैल्यू सेट आप बोलेंगे नो बडी शुड स्टील एनीथिंग इन क्लास यू शुड नॉट वेयर एवर समथिंग इज लाइंग इन क्लास रूम इट शुड लाइंग देयर नो बडी विल पिक अप एनी वन एल्सेस नोटबुक You tell no at the end of the session what happens. The good children lose their notebooks. There we are failing in our efforts of internalizing values. Okay. So if you will say all this repeatedly in class, then the child will be able to adapt to it. Okay. Act. Then what are the verbs? Learning outcome verbs. Act. Display, influence, solve, practice. Okay? Challenge the party for. Yeah, 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 yeah.
कोई बोल सकता है मैं कल से गुस्सा नहीं करूंगा चाहे कोई मुझे जितना भी एक्साइट करेगा मैं गुस्सा
ओके सो कम टू साइकोमोटर साइकोमोटर में क्या है
But perception will be somebody will come and see in case you know the God Allah. Teacher class he is Allah. It can be that perception also, and it can be the other perception can be that the children are involved in activity. They are all participating. They are enjoying the activity, so they are a little noisy. Behavior descriptions to produce activity from instruction or memory, carry out tasks from written or verbal instruction, recreate keywords. So, what is the what is the manip manipulation? Me, kya hota hai? Wo bhi psychomotor hai. It is not cognitive and affective. Okay. So, what is how it is psychomotor? Because आज तो करो है, but they are trying to change it. They, it is coming from memory cycle, and then there are activities there. What they are doing? They reproduce activity from instruction or memory. जैसे video game खेलते हैं, या फिर कोई games में किसी field में you have to you can give an example. So Naina can give an example like. In football, you have to you will be the front one, center one. You will be at the goalkeeper. Goalkeepers three will be your football. कभी हम दस प्लेयर के साथ भी खेलते हैं, चार के भी साथ खेलते हैं, हाँ? आठ बच्चे होते हैं, चार से भी तीन मल्ले वाला फुटबॉल तो ऐसे ही होता है। क्रिकेट में भी वही है। दो लोग भी क्रिकेट खेलते हैं, ग्यारह लोग भी क्रिकेट खेल सकते हैं, पांच लोग भी खेलते हैं। तो � so that is reproduce activity from instruction or memory, then carry out tasks from written or verbal instruction. When you play a video game, nowadays what you will see, children are not even ready to read your video game instructions. They do and then they improvise. Instructions are given, but they don't have the patience to read it. They want to keyword, recreate. Build, perform, execute, implement, acquire, conduct, operate. So, वो भी हम ये manipulate कर रहे हैं, acquire कर रहे हैं, then recreate कर रहे हैं, execute, implement, conduct, operate, okay? For example, they can have a, they will go to a water treatment plant, and then they will make a model. They will recreate the plant. They will discuss about the different topics, what are, how to do it and all. They produce activity from instruction or memory. So like that they will do. Then, okay, somebody else. Okay, so this is a not participated P2 class. The P2 attending a training is you should show maximum interest and participation. You will go for a PRP, Prospective Resource Persons Training of a CO in Patna. Then what you have to do? You have to participate. You have to be prompt. Then you will be selected. You should speak clearly in the English, everything. Your, uh, like the way you speak, it should be effective. It should be effective. I mean E, not A. E, effective. It should reach out. When I have a, what do you call, voice modulation, there should be voice modulation so that the, the people who are listening are actively listening. If you will speak very moderately at a pace where others, like it will be the same in the first column, second column, third column. So you have to speak action words, like action words. Okay, verbs. So it should come out like that, then only you will be selected, okay? So some of you should do that, so that I don't have to do this training alone. Had some of you qualified PRP, then we had the chance to do the session, share the sessions and do it, okay? Then the third category or level is the precision. Precision means what? Accurate. Precision means how you will do, it will be 
expecting the whole thing in short, precise. Okay? And exact. Skill, reliable, execute. Now you see who had like execute, skill, reliable. So what, how you have to read? Read it. Execute, skill, reliable. Execute is the verb. Execute, skill, reliable. So the skill has to be executed in a reliable manner. Independent of health, activity is quick, smooth, and accurate. Then examples of activity are perform a task or activity with expertise and to high quality, without assistance or instruction, able to demonstrate an activity to other learners. Then the keywords are demonstrate, complete, show, perfect, calibrate, control. Achieve, accomplish, master, refine. So, with to be pre precision demands what? Demonstration. Okay. Complete. Show. Perfect. Calibrate. Measure, calibrate. Okay. Control. Achieve, accomplish, master, refine. <coughs> These are the words. Then come to next is articulation. The behavior descriptors are adapt and integrate expertise to satisfy a new context or task. Example. So, uh, articulate means again copy. Hmm? Kind of? Yes, then. Then relate and combine associated activities to develop methods to meet value. No varying. Varying. Very noble requirements. Noble requirements. Noble requirements. Combine associated activities, different types of activities to be combined and related based on the, the precise activities it will be there. Precision has been achieved. Then articulation is being done. Okay? Then keywords. Keywords are solve, adapt, combine, coordinate, revise, integrate, adapt, develop, formulate. Modify, master. Then last one. Naturalization. <coughs> Instinctive, effortless, unconscious, mastery of activity and related skills at strategic level. So see what is naturalization? If na practice karaj hai, if na ho gaya, ki what? Instinctive, effortless. It is called as an instinct. Yeah. You know, when you go to the class, you stand up and say good morning. You get into the neglect. Yes. <laughs> the moment they see a teacher, they should go. Okay. Now those practices are gone. Now going is not a practice. But sorry is not coming up, which I'm observing. So sorry is not coming up from home. Nobody says sorry. They have to apologize and they are tongue-tied. They will not. So instinctive it has to be it has to be effortless. Unconscious mastery of activity and related skills at strategy. Hello? I'm sorry, I'm trying to find it. Yeah. See, what is to be done? Define the aim. Define aim is one, one thing. Approach and strategy for use of activities to meet. That is right. Okay? Exact issue. Okay? And, and it has to be repeatedly done. Naturalization will be achieved. When every subject we will, for example, certain values have to be done. Let us choose a few values for this session. Okay, you have to come to me with these thoughts. You will come to me, madam, this year we will choose five values. First month this value and all our activities should be aligned to that value. Okay, respect. If respect is the first value we choose.
so respect every teacher should show respect to other teachers every student should show respect to every student okay and you have to tell and this has to be uh, this has to be made very obvious in all the display boards everywhere in the school and april is the month for respect this is the value which we all have to imbibe okay and we all have to relate to it every topic you introduce everything you will do everything you will say will relate to this one okay and tell them to show this at home also that our april value word is respect okay action word what will be goes wishes what will be the actions when you are value you have chosen is respect choose yourself
सिंथेसिस में क्या होगा पार्ट्स ऑफ इंफॉर्मेशन टू क्रिएट अ न्यू होल डिजाइन अ लैब टू शो प्रेडिक्ट व्हाट विल हैपन इफ दिस एज दिस इज चेंज यूजिंग द प्रिंसिपल ऑफ साइंस और मैथ्स बहुत सारा होता है सिंथेसिस में हम लोग बहुत कुछ ने साइंस में मैथ्स में ओके डिस्क्राइब द इवेंट्स दैट माइट अपर इफ डिजाइन अ सिनेरियो यू आल्सो से इन स्टोरी इज नो वी हैव ओपन लेट क्वेश्चंस व्हाट इफ वी डिड नॉट टर्न अप यस देन व्हाट हैपन so you nowadays lot of uh, circumstances are being given like uh, what would have happened had a uh, uh, okay the story can be wrong and you go with the literal ending yes some other ending to it and but i was thinking some other chatting want to say <laughs> okay so for example three men on the boat for that story if you see so what can you say What if we had not returned? Hmm. What if we had sailed and gone away? So the children will have to synthesize. They will have to make a make a story. They will have to design a situation and react to it. And they will not be able to do had they not read about every character and known the whole story. Synthesis is the higher level. it is not at a lower level it is not direct it will be after application and analysis then evaluation judgment based how can you tell if your answer is reasonable this is one of the things like how would you repeat how would repeated trials affect your data for example kisi ne use kiya screw gauge and science people would understand to find the thickness of a specific rod Okay, then found this. Then the teacher may ask, "No, you have found this end thickness. What if you use the middle part of the rod? What if you use the bottom part of the rod? How is it varying? What is the average?" So that will come under evaluation. Okay, so these are some of the things which you use for assessment. Next, come to next. Now these are nowadays. earlier we used all these words but in competency based learning that is experiential learning and present day learning when you make a lesson plan there are these are words we should not have if we will go for sqa and they will see our lesson plans they will judge the school that the school has not gone for experiential learning workshop and they are still using your realize capacity to capacity to answer you right now many times people wrote so these are words to avoid conceptualize no listen self actualize a uh, real we used to say at the acme naturalization which we are seeing we used to say it as self actualization we said lata mangeshkar reach that self actualization okay then we have think memorize experience perceive understand understands is used very often but this is also a word to avoid because understanding is not measurable it is there on your whatsapp that i am using that same which i have avoided to you you have and so that too it is okay then phrases to avoid appreciation for acquainted with adjusted to awareness of capable of you have used these phrases in uh, in describing your students in the report card capable of comprehension of cognizant of enjoyment of conscious of familiar with interest and in, interested in knowledge of knowledgeable about understanding of these are not to be used phrases to avoid because not attainable kahan tak attainable hai understanding of a certain matter kitna understanding understanding ka rate kya okay so the words that the words that we use to think about those words go back revisit it tomorrow okay so come back to the last one a note on smart check learning outcome has to be specific measurable So all of these are not specific, not measurable, not attainable, achievable, not reasonable, and 
This intelligence enables us to recognize, create, reproduce, and reflect on music as demonstrated by composers, conductors, musicians, vocalists, and sensitive listeners. Interestingly, there is often an effective connection between music and the emotions, and mathematical and musical intelligences may shape uh, common thinking processes. Young adults with this kind of intelligence are usually singing or drumming to themselves. They are usually quite aware of sounds others may miss. So see, they are aware, they, they, when they hear certain things, they are able to reflect better, think better and take notes, you know. Uh, seven notes, sorry, not eight. Seven notes and uh, fourteen notes. Okay, Indian, uh, our Hindustani classical music, we have Sare Gama, Parha, Nisa. And uh, Western music, so it is having 14, okay, 14 different notes. So if a child is very smart, child might have learnt uh, Hindustani classical, okay, but when the child will sit on a piano, he will understand that he has to go to the top of the notes, so he will do it, so he will do it. किसी भी सॉन्ग को वो हिंदुस्तानी क्लासिकल का बजा सकता है तो वो बजा देता है, इज़ इट? That is intelligence because they can relate to the sound and the notes. Whether the song is going on the upper note or a lower note, they will be able to. And the same thing is with mathematics. Maths they will understand because it is with numbers. कितना नोट है, कितना नंबर्स है, तबला बजाना है या तो बहुत सारे लोग बच्चों को बचपन में ये सब इंस्ट्रूमेंट्स बजाने को बोलते हैं, so that they are able to concentrate and learn mathematics also better. Okay, then we have logical and mathematical intelligence is ability to calculate, quantify, consider propositions and hypotheses and carry out complete mathematical operations. It enables us to perceive relationships and connections and to use abstract symbolic thought, sequential reasoning skills, and inclusive and deductive thinking patterns. So what's right here? Thinking patterns based on numbers. Induced by, deduced, deducted by symbolic. Logical intelligence is usually well developed in mathematicians, scientists, and detectives. Badla dekha? Dekha So, Amida Bachchan? Was nice. So, this is called Logical intelligence. Okay? They, they go, whenever there is a crime thriller, there is logic, lot of logical intelligence, no? The one who kills tries to go apart, but then one who detects goes far. And the traces are left and their person is caught. This is all about logical intelligence. It's usually well developed mathematicians. Scientists and detectives. Logic लगाना पड़ता है ना इसमें fire hydrant क्या है इसमें क्या use करना है कितना पानी का हमारा वो बंदा आया उसने कुछ भी design बनाया we didn't have a idea that we should get a map of it and then he made a order a tank which was made of fiber syntax वाला tank तो इसका pressure तो ज़्यादा रहेगा the most you have seen most by so the person from fire department came and he said इतना pressure पे तुम लगाए ना पानी आएगा वो tank का क्या होगा वो ऐसा बच्चा जाए पता नहीं वो बंदा क्या काम करता था हमसे खरीदवा भी लिया tank हमने लगवा भी लिया खरीद के उसने जैसा जैसा order के but we are not aware then it was decided कि वो underground लगेगा underground के tank को फिर से ठीक कराया because it has to be a civil one so made of brick and mortar. So the thing is, this is all logic. 
those people were doing work but they were not able to relate with it they were just doing because they were workers so young adults with lots of logical intelligence are interested in patterns categories and relationships they are drawn to arithmetic problems and strategy games and experiments you will be surprised to know calculus is used to find out the sharpness and the angle of the of the blade of the knife which is used for the deepest brain surgery children ask us na calculus kyun padhenge if you want to measure the area of skin aapko calculus janna padta hai okay it cannot be calculated by mensuration because there are so many faults and uh, Prices and other things, no. So to calculate all that, calculus is used. Okay. Come to the existential. Nowadays it is all multidisciplinary. कोई जो डॉक्टर है वो जो डिजाइन करेगा बायोमेडिकल इंस्ट्रूमेंट्स, they will be engineers, mathematicians. Those who study maths, they do. They have designed the knife. The laser knife that will reach the deepest area of the brain where surgery can be done, which was not done earlier. If you will read some journals, you will get to know. I was reading about it yesterday in some Harvard Medical News that I found. So uh, think about it. Maths wale ne design kya instrument for the doctor to conduct the surgery. Then somebody was telling, my child uh, is all the times playing video game. मुझे तो इसको doctor बनाना है. Then a friend of mine said that's the best thing that the child is doing, because yesterday us doctors used to cut and use a blade and anesthesia and then cut. Today's doctors have to use devices which they have to reach out fast. If they are using uh, uh, video games, they will be better doctors. So our children are adapting to what they will use later. We have to understand and uh, support. existential intelligence sensitivity and capacity to tackle deep questions about human existence such as the meaning of life why we die and how we spiritual knowledge next okay? lot of questions are asked no sometimes children at very young age start asking okay the moment in class ek buddha wala chapter aata hai bahut sare bacche vegetarian ho jate hain Sad हो जाते हैं घर में जाके I don't know if you have experienced this with your child. I did. So Buddha uh, chapter was going on. We did not realize. She searched a lot of things on the internet. Saw a lot of YouTube videos on Buddhist philosophy, Buddha and all that, and discussed with us. We felt very good that it is nice. Then when she started asking questions. Then we realized, you know, there has to be a full stop. It is radiating too much. Mythology is okay, and these thoughts are okay, but at what age, what, and how much? So, question sensitivity and capacity to tackle deep questions about human existence, such as meaning of life, why we died, and how did we get here? Existential intelligence. The children who will be connecting to the mankind and all. and ask questions about that then interpersonal you understand i'm not reading it bodily kinesthetics capacity to manipulate objects with variety of physical skills ticket so at least one day dances one day okay so uh, linguistic they are able to language is better they become novelists journalists public speakers lawyers okay writing reading telling stories music solving crossword puzzles intrapersonal within yourself intrapersonal intelligence the capacity to understand oneself one's thoughts and feelings and to use such knowledge in planning directing one's life intrapersonal intelligence involves not only an appreciation of self but also the human condition it is evident in psychologists spiritual leaders and philosophers okay these young adults may be shy they are very aware of their own feelings and are Self-motivating. 
Then spatial intelligence is the ability to think in three dimensions. Core capacities include medical, me mental imagery, spatial reasoning, image manipulation. They become graphics, photographers, okay, movie makers, video editors. Okay, these careers they adapt to. And active imagination, sailors, pilots, sculptors, painters, architects, all exhibit spatial intelligence. Young adults with this kind of intelligence may be fascinated with masses of jigsaw puzzles and speed free time drawing or daydreaming. Okay, you can use this link to know further. So let us come to the next page. So these are the multiple intelligence activities or you can use these in the activities. Okay, you can write am I musical, am I this, what is the activity you are using. So now let us come to writing the lesson plan. Okay, these are the uh, verbs you have on this in the uh, in the handout that I have forwarded, the soft copy. Okay, visual spatial, you see mind maps and all these come under this. Okay, role play, body kinesthetics. You can just use this, you know all these things. Come to the lesson plan. Let me choose the page. And then, uh, some people can volunteer and help me in distributing. So you do one thing, all LKG teachers, LKG, A, B, C, D, E together, okay, first nursery, A, B, C, D, E together, you will choose one topic and write the lesson plan. LKG together, nursery together, one, two, three, four, like this. So one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, eleven, twelve, start from here. Everyone gets up and uh, two people volunteer to make the chart paper to go half and distribute to every class. Nursery and
one in row, one format only. Number the tables. Nursery is one something item. I don't know how much item. Nursery is table one. Lower KG is two. Nursery number one, lower KG is one. Lower KG is two. Too much talking is going on, please. You will not be able to hear me. Upper KG is three. Standard one, number four. Standard two, five. Okay? Nursery to two, one, two, three, four, five. English is six. Maths is seven. English is six. Hindi is eight.
सभी सारे टेबल्स पर जो बने काम अच्छे से मुझे समझाते हुए वो इस काम विच टेबल दो विच टेबल इस टेबल को फिनिश कबाब पास यू कैन लस्सी इन दिस काम के काम पैकेट ऑफ लस्सी